In this video, we want to find the limit as h approaches 0 of 2 plus h raised to the fifth power plus 3 minus 2 to the fifth plus 3 all over h. So the biggest obstacle in solving this limit is expanding the 2 plus h to the fifth power. So for that, we're going to use a binomial series. So we have 5 to 0, 2 to the fifth, h to the 0. And for each term, we're going to increase this bottom number from 0 going up to 1, 2, etc., up to 5. And then 2 to the 5th goes on to the 4th, 2 to the 3rd, squared, 1st, and then 0. And then the exponent of h starts at 0, goes up by 1, and then ends up at 5. So in order to solve for these combinations, what you could use is Pascal's triangle. So we want to go down to 5, so that's going to be the row with uh, the second number being 5. So that's going to be this uh, row over here. So these are going to be the coefficients of the combination. So this is 1, this is 5, and then we go down to 10, and then 10 again, and then 5, and then lastly 1. Now 2 to the 5th is 32, 2 to the 4th is 16, 2 cubed is 8, 2 squared is 4, 2 to the first is 1, 2 to the 0 is also 1. So when we multiply 1 and 32, we get 32. 5 times 16 is 80. 10 times 8 is also 80. 10 times 4 is 40. 5 times 2 is 10. And then 1 times 1 is 1. So what I did was... Uh, I wrote it backwards. So we start with h to the fifth, that's this term, that's coefficient one. Then h to the fourth has coefficient 10. h cubed is 40. h squared is 80. h to the first is 80. And then the constant here is 32. So now we just need to put it all together. We have two plus h to the fifth plus three becomes this whole long expression. And then two to the fifth is 32 plus three is 35 and that's gonna be all over H now we can simplify 32 plus 3 is 35 so now we just have this one long expression okay the next step 35s are gonna cancel and we can factor out an H from the numerator so factoring out an H gives us H to the fourth plus 10 H cubed plus 40 H squared plus 80 H plus 80 and now the H's are going to cancel. So we're left with just whatever is inside the parentheses from the previous step. And when H approaches zero, all of these go to zero. And so we're left with 80 as our final answer.